Welcome to New York. The year is 2329. A city where immortality is no longer a rich man's wet dream, but the new reality bought and sold like candy. In this dazzling metropolis, the promise of eternal life hides a dark, insidious truth. I suffered a near-death experience, and as a former detective, I am marked with many scars of the past. I try to rebuild myself and try and get back into the field, only to be turned away. You come back. My hands are tied. I have one last chance to get back out there, and that's to take on this off-the-books job. Under the radar, a mysterious covert mission from my chief. This is big. It could unravel the foundations of this very city. With only the help of a young and brilliant police liaison, Sarah Kai. Bullshit, didn't he? And I had such good stats up to now. We get plunged into the shadowy depths of New York's elite. Together, we navigate our way through a labyrinth of secrets and lies, risking everything. In a city where immortality comes at a price, me and Sarah Kai are prepared to pay it all in the name of justice. Welcome ladies and gents, my name is Crypt and welcome to Nobody Wants to Die. Living in pain, plagued by sickness, haunted by your own looming mortality? Not anymore. Now there's Icaret, a technological miracle that lets us transfer consciousness from one body to another. So immortality, That's basically, right. yeah. Humanity's wildest dream has been fulfilled. The dream of immortality. Now, when sickness or old age starts to you down... <laughs> Bro, you, you want a new body for a hundred dollars? ...at your local government auction house. Give yourself and your loved ones a new lease on life. Yeah, yeah. Let's get a new body. Forget, the body subscription service is mandatory for all citizens 21 and older. So protect your investment. Always avoid illicit substances. Never skip any mandated shell inspections. And prioritize your well-being. Physical, psychological, and especially financial. So let me... Any lapse subscription payments will result in your body being submitted to a bailiff auction. Bailiff. And remember, any and all violations will be prosecuted by the Department of Mortality. Alright, let me, let me get this straight, yeah. My FPS is just tanked, so we're gonna we're gonna look at getting that fixed. But let me let me just get this straight, yeah. At the age of twenty one, everybody's is supposed to be getting the uh basically enrolled into having your brain sacrificed. And don't you already know who the murderer is? Let, right, uh, twenty. So instead of the draft, they've changed that up now. Right, you get in at the age of twenty-one. You are required to sign up to this thing so that you can replace some older guy's brain with your like. Bro, this is fucked. Alright, good start. That's not the point. And at least tell me what's going on. Just watch, right? Just watch, okay? This is the best part. Grace questioning the suspect. And when are you gonna question me? You want me to question you? Don't you want to? Uh, mm. <laughs> Should I handcuff you? We always uh, handcuff suspects. I think you'd better. Sounds dangerous. I'm always dangerous. Too bad you didn't warn me before we got married. Would that have changed your mind? If it had, where do you think we'd be now? A stupid question. Maybe, stupid question. Maybe I wouldn't have. Huh? Bro, you just neck the whole bottle. Where's the lady going? Where's Rachel? She just vanish. All units, code three zero five. 
prohibition violation at intersection of... Breaking news. The president today signed into law a controversial bill reducing the age limit for free body subscriptions, despite earlier promises to the contrary. Fucking politics. So now it's at a younger age. Oh, right. So welcome everybody, but this is a uh, detective game. Uh, I'm a big fan of detective games, I've played a lot of the CSI games when they were point clickers. This piqued me interest the moment I saw the video, the trailer for it, and I figured I'd pick it up and have a go. So right now, we are playing as James. And a great gesture from a great man, Edward Green sponsors Central Park Exhibition. This Friday treasures uh, commemorating the heritage of the old continent will fill Central Park free admission for all New York City residents. Thanks to the generosity of well-known politician and philanthropist Edward Green. Read on pages three and five. All right, that's cool. Oh, I could have just used that. Uh, never mind. I read that bit. Let's have a look. What else we got? Congratulations on your new body. May it save you for many more years. Uh, exam. A hundred fucking years of work and taxes. Great. Body lending agreement number 992-8372-1009-2329 for an indefinite period signed on this day, October 9th, 2329. Yes, that's it's obviously set in the future. You'll see a bit in a, in a little while. Uh, at the Consciousness Transmission Center in New York City between James Cara, which is the main character, holding ID 7829384637050922209. Here and after, referred to as the recipient and the Office of Health, here and after, referred to as the lender, subject of the contract body, age 42, so he's 42 years old and he's 6 foot tall. He weighs 163 pounds. That's nice. Uh, seems like a decent boat. Oh, we got a gun sight here, look. Sullivan. Saved my ass more than once. This gun's name is Sullivan. Cool. Karen, how you feeling? Ready to get back in the saddle, Chief. They uh, sent you the papers. Oh, I know. I'm looking at them. You hear this? Fuck! What are you... Don't tear them up! Fuck! The accident was barely two weeks ago. Look, the committee already thought you were a hot mess. Trying to come back this soon? That's just got him convinced. You're no fucking medical miracle, James. Chief, we've been busting our humps in the same department for half a century. You know I know this fucking job like nobody else. Yeah, so you give me know I've got your back too. Come on, Chief. You gotta let me come back. My hands are tied. Officially. Yeah? So unofficially, I'm all ears. Political case. Discreet. I'm listening. You'd be doing a favor for a guy whose signature trumps every test and commission out there. Fuck yes! <laughs> uh, I owe you, Chief. <laughs> Goddamn sick leave had me climbing the walls. Not another word or I'll change my mind. Also, without your sync tests, can't get you back in the system. So I'm gonna put you with a liaison officer. She'll be the one with full access. A babysitter? Fucking hell. You asked for it, sunshine. Just what we need a babysitter. We'll put her on. <clears throat> what the... Whoa. Oh, what? That's for the brave new world. So immersive you could drown. But of course, drowning is forbidden. Blocked like any other exit from paradise. I did not Carl? realize we were James fucking Carl? killers and no, not. No way. Forget it, Chief. Those are not. You're already on the line. James. Sarah Cott. Sarah. James Carroll. Let me go pull some strings. Back it up. You 
dropped us into some bullshit, didn't he? And I had such good stats up to now. Crap. Yeah, I'm fucking thrilled to be working with you, too. Uh, what can I say? Your reputation precedes you, especially after you fucked that hologram down there. That train. Uh, I don't remember much. It's close, it's close case, okay. The case is closed. We were unlucky. That's it. Of course. Guys like you get away with bloody murder. I want to take a moment to calm down here. What I need is somebody who treats the rules like more than just a piece of paper to wipe their privileged ass with. Okay, I'm back. Because we're best friends now, right? Sorry, boss. Sarah, I've said to all the authors. What the hell? I suggest you find something else to wipe your ass with. Steiner, out. All right, let's get the show on the road. I need the address of the nearest post office. Fine. Which, which, how do I get back in the car? I, actually, why the fuck is this, the buildings in this on the ceiling? Is it ceiling? Oh, man, this is trippy. Right, anyways. Uh... That girl in the hat overshadows more and more of the city, doesn't she? Sorry? The auction ad? I haven't seen it. How could you not see it? It's on every goddamn corner. Looks like TS-45-7. You're in Times Square? Uh, the best movies are here. I have my business here. I have business here. Half the city's had business there lately, thanks for that new brothel. I am not in a brothel. <laughs> sure, and I totally no, I think that might have been a bad choice. Over the package. Platform 53D, terminal free. Uh, stop me, engine. Yo, hold up. How do we see out the window? Oh, there we go. Having a goal. Yo, this is actually really good. I like this. Look at this. Activity. An alternative to focusing on the symptoms. And the memories. I'm 120 years old. And I don't have any strength left to keep recalling the past. I did, oh, it's 120. That's a long time to be alive, fella. I gotta say, this game is like wow. I've only seen this little section as well, so it's not like I've seen loads. But even this little section that we're in the Times Square is clean. Looks so super nice. Yo, they're just cut in. What do you mean? Oh, come on. Everybody knows you don't give two greasy rat shits about regulations. The only thing I ask is that we act professionally, okay? I'm willing to give it a shot. No promises. Great. Better than nothing. It's the spirit. Let's not drink just in case she smells it on me, me breath. Let's, let's at least get into Sarah's good books. Just for now, anyways. Alright, so what is this about? Are we, uh... Picking her up. Terminal three. Have a look.
Welcome. Need a new body. Get one today for hundred dollars. Auction every Friday. Enter your full name and shipping code. James Cara seven seven one one two P. Police shipment. Additional verification required. Enter badge number. Nine eight four. No authorization. Shit, Sarah. I need access. Oh, right. Uh, enter my number. 116-739. Thanks. 116-739. Thank you. The package is on its way. We hope you enjoy it. What is these? What is these? How do I check? Yo, that is a sexy car. I'm not gonna lie. That is a beautiful car. Have you opened it yet? One second. I have to move my car. Yeah, I'm just admiring the car, bro. This is just... Oh. Let's get in. It's a beautiful car. Love it. It's a shame I cannot drive it. That is a... The only downside. All right, let's have a look at this package. Oh, we, we, we've got it covered. This information is confidential and will be automatically destroyed after reading. Select a section to read the files. Uh, let's do victim first. His name is Edward Green. Who? Hard to confuse this mug with anybody else. Green's sponsoring some kind of exhibition in Central Park. I saw it on the news earlier. Oh, yeah. I heard about that. Well, let me look it up. Yep. Supposed to be in a few days. What are these bumps on his forehead over here? Yeah, on the uh, right side of his feet? Edward. Oh, he's got them all the way down. Oh, shit. Sarah? You okay? Shit. Shit. Oh, I'm reading up on green. Holy Voice fuck. acting is you know clean. Who this guy is? Feet. Want to back out? No. No, I'm good. What are we supposed to do? We get in. Holy a right. Delivered to the Consciousness Transmission Center. No sweat. You're telling me the Covenant Chief, the guy who used to be the Secretary of Health, his Icarites just lying around in a dead body? Fucking hell! Why isn't this going through official channels? It's a favor for Chief Steiner. What's Chief Steiner got to do with Edward Green? Guys like Green have been shaking down the city for 200 years. Last thing they want is the wrong people putting hands on their. Ignorance. I don't know if That's I was we slide did a good thing now. It is right. We'll come off like heroes. Well, heroes to the right people anyway. Look on the bright side. I'm betting Green's gratitude hits the gas on that dream promotion of yours. Where's his body? Fifth Avenue, top floor. Looks like it's Green's own apartment. You'll get a chance to see the wannabe Olympus with your own eyes. Yeah. Let's get on with it. Attention, documentation will be automatically destroyed. Oh, I thought they were gonna go out with a bang then, James, but never mind. I, um, I know you're not reinstated yet, but have you recovered from the accident? Like, mentally, I mean? You're looking out for me or for yourself? For both of us. We're. We're in the same boat, right? Listen, you just kick back and put your feet up, all right? You've got nothing to worry about. I'll ping you when I get there. Car out. Car out. We'll move. We're on the move. After tripping yet again.
Um... So I took this job. I'd take any job at that point, even though political cases fester like rust-laced wounds. I was off to hang out with high society, of which I always had a low opinion. Maybe because it consisted mostly of low people. You know what? I don't know if I like this main character. <laughs> His attitude's a bit. Shite. At this altitude, the air was so clean that without a smoke, I was beginning to suffocate. But I'm feeling that noir feel, get like the noir feeling. Seven two five hundred height. Okay, it's not joking. Not, I don't even know where to begin with the graphics. To be fair, it's all, actually on medium. Looks really nice. Hey, got legs. <laughs> and John, it's that meme where you always check for your. Uh, Legs in video games. Uh. Oh. It's Shit. James, camera. This was supposed to be an accident. Fuckers hanging from the last cherry tree. What do you mean the last? Like last, last? Mm hmm. Let's pull the echo right and get out of here. Hint mode. Press caps in the hint mode. Oh, okay, so it's like a scanning thing. All right. What have we got here? What do they need protection for? Replacing a whole body just because somebody gouged out your eye is... Uh, unprofitable, I guess? Not for him. Ooh. And here he scores a few points. Points? For what? This engine could push a car up past 120 miles per hour. Running on gasoline, on the ground. You know, it's hard enough to imagine driving on the ground. That sounds so shocking. <laughs> no, I call bullshit on that one. Well, we had cars going two ten, in some cases, depending on what they were doing with it. Do you know what I mean? Like, holy moly! I've got some horse uh, saddles. It may have wings. Horses? No, pegasi. Um, Sarah, that's a horse. Pegasi are mythical creatures. <laughs> Some paleontologist you are. These days, horses are mythical too. Ah, oh, bro, that's no mythical animals are fictional. They never existed. Whereas horses are extinct, like dinosaurs. <laughs> of course. Damn. He really got cooked, didn't he? Oh, sorry, I well, skipped dialogue then. Yeah, yeah, I'm just exploring. Let me look around first, just a little bit. Right. Like a door. It must be open remotely. Maybe I can find something with X-ray. Well, I want to look around first. I want to examine some of this stuff. Remarried. What happened to the first wife? Refused Ekerite. Died a natural death. But wasn't that illegal? She would have had a top-down warrant served, right? Green only introduced that legislation after her death. Hang on. Are you telling me Green couldn't handle it that his wife died, and he fucked up our whole fucking society because of it? As far as I can tell, people's bullshit personal trauma is always what fucks up society. Yep, not wrong there. Oh, can we get a nice... Let's take a picture of that. I wonder if he hung women like that under his tree too. Some enjoy that. <laughs> Discovered clues on this. Uh... Oh, green 2324. Green's signature. Did he paint this? He's had some time to learn. There's a nice picture though. Oh, we've got some uh, nice cigars in here. Probably synthetic. What you might call tobacco adjacent or shit, maybe they are real. James, tell me you're not going to steal a cigar. Not like he's gonna smoke it. Great. Now you can add thief to your CV. Nah man. Isn't it didn't, you know what, actually I'll I'll let that happen. Yeah, true. Okay. So he's interested in art. 
Doesn't seem to be too much he's not interested in. Uh, I did not mean to do that. Art in tribute to immortality, 25th of October, 2329, between between 25th of October, 2329, and the 31st of December, 2329. Central Park becomes a museum full of works by the most eminent artists. Come and see for yourself, gather family and friends, die on October 25th, totally free. Why is it worth it? Monumental exhibits referring to the culture and tradition of the old continent not only to inspire reflection on the past but also radiate unwavering optimism about the future. The main theme of the exhibition is humanity's triumph over the ills of the past over fate, chance, death and time. Let's celebrate this victory together. All works have been selected under the supervision of the New York College of Art Curators. The sole sponsor of the exhibition is Edward Green. Thank you on behalf of all citizens. Oh, so he's also um, he's also the sponsor. So there's a reason there that he could be um, killed for that. Oh, you know what I mean? Maybe there, there is that there. Oh, these statues are nice. Oh, whoa, look at that. A view from. Olympus, awesome. even though we're all immortal, only some of us live like gods. Oh, yeah, that's a line. That is a. I like that line. Do that again. Oh, you're not gonna do it again. He said he saw perfectly as well. He was clearly trying to get rid of those. Didn't make it. Or someone stopped them. I'm gonna leave that. Maybe I'll just let sleeping dogs lie. <sighs> Thanks. My blood pressure didn't need to get any higher. Oh, I should have read it actually. You know, I should have. I should have read that. Do we have anything on here that's a bit suspicious? Green sponsored it. When I was little, I wanted to be an astronaut. He does everything, After Green, doesn't he? After Green shut down the whole program. Well. The first mission did crash. Yeah, during the landing, everything else went smooth as silk. You know, it had to be some kind of sabotage. You mix in political bullshit. Some more cigars poof, over here. Holy! It's got loads. See how much good he's done. He helps children, orphans, supposedly. Uh, we can't know for certain. Green Foundation Green. off. Maybe he really oh, did help he's got oh, sure. Green Foundation off. Help them all sign up for the first body subscriptions. A real man of the people. At least that's what he wants you to see. Right. I've never understood this stuff. Yet it doesn't surprise me in the least that Green was into it. <laughs> what is it? It's a good painting, though. I'm not gonna lie. What is this? Guy has a fragrance museum in his home. Aromatherapy helps with synchronization. Aromatherapy, sure. Pity we're all rolling around in sewage. <gasps> James, is that chocolate? That's what it says here. Can I um? Oh, can I ask you to do something for me? <laughs> what? You want me to steal evidence? I thought you had a stick up your ass about thievery. No. I mean, yes. Listen, could you... Could you describe the scent to me? Oh, listen, I'll steal it for you if you want, and we can, you can share it with me later. If you really want some, I can take a piece and you can try it. Don't be dark chocolate, please. It's kind of like... <laughs> Tobacco, grease, and a mushroom. <laughs> None of those. Sort of like grease, but it's soft and gentle. That's how it hits the nose, anyway. I'll tell you what, why don't you try describing it in a way that doesn't sound gross? Give it a shot. Go and give a proper description. I couldn't. I couldn't even describe it myself. <laughs> a cigar, rubber, and a leather jacket. <laughs> uh, 
We'll do we'll do leather jacket. Like uh, leather jacket. You know those relic clothes from museums? Made from animals. Like that. Okay. Um let's try this another way. Uh does it make you feel something when you smell it? Emotions. Why are we sat here smelling chocolate? Games, anything. You think it's edible? Glossing right over the emotion talk. Okay. Look, that sample's probably over a hundred years old. Food spoiled in the past. It could make you really sick. I'll do it one more try. Please be somewhat better than then. <laughs> the longer I smell it, the more I want to eat it. So, soft, fluid grease, huh? A leather jacket from a museum, and you want to eat it. Exactly. Okay. Um, thank you <laughs> very much. <laughs> that is the best description for chocolate. <laughs> I love it. It smells like grease, soft. It smells like a leather jacket, and you also want to eat. That is the best description for chocolate. I'm gonna do an X-ray on this. See what this does. Uh, the device allows to X-ray objects. Hold right mouse and follow the wires to find a generator. And when you find a generator, at Aim at it while aim while holding right mouse to scan it. All right. Uh, object ID door panel description. Can I need go? Code not required. Let's do what we're supposed to do over here because I'm I'm kind of skipping ahead. I think. Let me actually let me go scan this other door as well. Actually, let's do this and then we'll go and take that picture. Also, no code required for this one. Oh, the volume, that is cool. Right, anyways, let's go do, do this down here and then we'll, um, we'll move on to these other rooms, seeing as I've done everything in this room. Right, so let's take a picture of this. I mean, it could be him. It doesn't cut it. We have to be sure. Hmm. This is guesswork, James. I won't identify him. Not officially. Uh, I have an idea. And you won't like it. This is a federal case, James. And we're supposed to pull Green's Icarite, not someone's. Moving on to reconstruction. Uh, reconstruct it. the reconstructor you can reconstruct fragments of the event based on the information collected hold the left mouse when the bar is on left bar is active hold right mouse when the right bar is active hold left and mouse on both easy that's simple enough Uh, the reconstructor allows you to rewind time. The yellow area in the reconstructor indicates the moment when something significant happened. Hold Q to move the indicator to the yellow area in the reconstructor. If you have moved the indicator too far, hold E to return to the relevant moment. Right, okay. You seen this? What? Yeah, I went past that straight away. Hold E to move the indicator to the yellow area in the re yeah. I know. Kind of I went anomaly. past it. It's green. Pull it zicker right and let's go. Alright, uh, enter the anomaly zone and look for more traces. Point to his head and activate uh, to analyze his, his brain, basically. The icarites melted. So, that's his insurer's problem. 
Come on, let's go. Sarah, he's dead. What? Like, you mean final death? Dead? Well, just... I, I mean, fix it. Just reconstruct it or something. Just do something, James. Look, Sarah, I've seen this before. It's not some random glitch. The thing's been oxidized, understand? Somebody wanted to make damn sure Green wasn't coming back. Oh, I am in deep, deep shit. Look, he's hanging from a fucking tree. What someone? Then why is the tree burned? James, this is crazy. If something goes wrong, you're hung out to dry. At least we have a theory of the crime. Omega code 112358. Suspected murder. Uh... The right side of the body is more heavily charred. The tree must have exploded after he'd been hanged. James, stop doing this. It wasn't just a fire. Find the cause and Oh, that is, um, that is amazing. Uh, hold Q or E to swipe over the yellow area in the reconstructed, then enter the anomaly zone and look for more traces. Sorry. Chill your knickers, but we're gonna be fine, alright. I'm using my x-ray scanner now, alright. We're, we're gonna find out what's been happening. The device allows x-ray objects to hold, right? Yeah, we've done this before. So this is fine. Um, well, I can see you're having a great time. Right. Go down this way first, because there's two wires on the other way. Oh, well, we're not doing that one then. Alright, we got a, quite a few wires here. I kind of feel like it's going to be one of these. So let's go and open the floor and we find out if we can fix it. Easy peasy. <laughs> This is so immersive, man. I'm full into this. this course of action. I should have known better. I should have known you could handle it. It's just an incorrect rule, I thought. Surely Kara can't buck up something that simple. Chief, listen. I found a file. It's got your name on it. My name. What are you? All right. You're done. You hear me? Get out of there now. I want those files on my desk, ASAP, along with the suicide. Oh, it's a suicide now. I thought it was an accident. You can call it a motherfucking ascension. Oh, <laughs> <I can. laughs> Just get it off our books. Naughty, naughty. Perhaps murder. Murder, perhaps. Well, you know, that's a, a funky bottle. Syn uh, syn synth synthetic gin. 
That's before June 25, 29. Like, yeah, I'm all right. I don't want to drink any of that. What's this? Meditation. That's a likes reading too. Someone with the president? Hmm. I recognize him. Wait, it's green. Old shell? The first one. Oh wow. He's young there and he's on the ground. That's bullshit. 2025. Lying. The fact that even before inventing the Icarite, he was a big shot in politics. Green, never doubt yourself and you will achieve great things. Nah, there ain't no way they've been doing this since 2029. At all. What the fuck is this? This is a bicycle. Or rather a wheel off a bike. And people rode on it? How? Like a motorcycle. But you had to push those things around and around with your feet to make it go. Ouch. Yeah, it's not that bad. I, I ride bike. So. The city of New York presents the key to the city to Edward Green. Okay. But anyways, let's do this thing over here because we need to... Uh... Hold space along with Q and e. R E to speed up the reconstruct and rewinding. That's what caused the explosion. It's getting more and more obvious. I'll look for any pre-explosion traces, then we're out of here. James, I wasn't born yesterday. You said that before, and I don't believe you. Ooh. Okay, this is some kind of emblem. 10, 21, 10, 0, 2, 1, 2, 3, 2, 9. With an Ouroboros. It's starting to get interesting. Someone is it Ouroboros? I think it's Ouroboros. What's up with the snake? Mm, check the encyclopedia. Mm, how does one sec check the uh, encyclopedia? What's this one? Uh, did I do this one? I think I did this one. I have a feeling I did this one. Oh wait, now we got blood down here. Okay. Someone tried to smash that glass before the explosion. Cracked it and left a handprint. Matches Green's body. Stop it. James, you've got to stop this. Oh, what's going on over here? What? What's he doing? Oh, you're finally paying attention. Or did somebody else use Green's forehead like a ball peen hammer? Baby, he he had. killer in the reconstruction? He covered his tracks pretty damn skillfully. So someone was here. Fucking hell. What? You gonna tattle to the chief again? Would you just let that drop already? What's done is done. No point in picking at it. That went too fast. Wait, wait, wait. We're not going to work like this. There's got to be at least a baseline of trust here. Yeah, well, that's all well and good, except we're running out of time to figure out how... I'm missing some on bits. Fire. So, come on. I'm skipping stuff by accident. What the hell? Shit. What happened? The fuse is just blue. What? Why? The reconstructor needs massive amounts of energy. Sometimes the limiter doesn't adjust to the environment and pop. Blown fuses. I'm sorry, I need to find a way to change this, because... I'm doing this speed up thing and it's skipping dialogue. I need to, I, you can't change it. I just, I just want to do it. There you go. You turned on the emergency lights. Well, I wonder what the chief would have to say about that. Don't thank me, and for fuck's sake, get a move on. Something went off here. I'm feeling...
Oh, we got a we got a pocket Probably ball. some kind of relic. To the best of friends, always auspicious winds. Green. That asshole had friends. Hard to believe. I'm getting a bad head off this thing. Can I? No. How do I? Uh, how do I get off this? I wonder which one's the best friend now. I wonder why a gift from Green is in his own home. Yeah, good point. Good point. That is Let's true. See what the patient has to say. What's this? Check something out for me, would you? I need to know about a drug called Prose of Life. Introduced in 2208. It's based on fluoxetine. An antidepressant. Uh, How long did Green get psychiatric treatment? Looks like he's officially been in therapy for... 156 years according to statistics that's pretty much normal for people who've lived as long as he has it'll be worth checking the file to see if he mentioned anything about a suicide okay. is there anything else He's got a stab wound in the back. Matched to Green's blood type. He was fighting with someone. Or he cut himself as he jumped. Maybe. We learn fast. So let's see if he jumped from somewhere. No, I feel like he hit no maybe no. He fell from there. Cut himself on the railing. There should be blood on it. Alright, let's get up there then, shall we? Let's have a look. No, but they've got blood. I'll come back to that later. I don't see blood there. Someone must have pushed him. No trace of blood on the railing. So he didn't cut himself here. This is weird. No, but like this is not. We can use this. I'm stuck. Hey, oh, get out of me! <laughs> Green's fingerprints are on the railing. So he was leaning against it? Looks that way. <laughs> Boy. Um, in, he's inside my body again. Get out. I'm stuck. They came from this side. They? Half of the reconstruction is inconsistent. Someone must have been messing with it. We don't have enough information to find the other one. What is this? How do you think this went down? Green gave up after the fight and did whatever the perpetrator told him to. I'm thinking he put the rope around his own neck and then destroyed his own icarite. <clears throat> well, in any case, Green didn't jump. Someone pushed him. I don't think... Why would he tie the rope?
The UV lamp allows you to discover traces on surfaces. Hold left mouse and explore the area to discover traces. Follow the traces to find more leads. Let me just get this shit set up. Blood type B R H plus. Never heard of that one, but yeah. He was walking up these stairs. Unusual shape. But he was lying here. Okay, so we're lying here. Let's see what happened. He must have been punched, knocked over, maybe, or something, something along those lines. More like he's begging for mercy. Yeah. Another trace of blood. Hit it with the UV lamp. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's doing the wrong one though, that's the issue. There we go. connect all right so we we'll come back to here well let's just skip a bunch of stuff in between and there's Let's have a look here, what we got. He's got something on his clothes. Some kind of chemical? Huh. The reconstructor's coming up goose eggs on its composition. Must be rare as shit then. Is it just me or is Sarah getting quite invested right now? Because she's she definitely changed her tone. Right, where are we at? Stretches across the floor. I'll switch to UV. What is that? This don't look pretty. Let me tell you that. Unknown substance. The tracks lead this way. Looks like Green was rummaging around the transformer. So did he break this or? Oi, jeez. Do that again, what the hell? The fact that it, this affects me like that is quite actually like, kind of cool. <laughs> that is actually amazing. I love it. Let me do that a bit faster. <laughs> Wait, put it back down. Oh, it didn't work like that. <laughs> you don't know, like that. Oh, okay. The cables are torn out. Same as the one around Green's neck. You think he did it? That could be someone made bro, it a bit, I think. The following substances were collected. Detected. Synthetic spirit and cocktail wax. Oil. This medic look like he's done everything. No. Have I gone past the thing? I think I've gone past it. There's something here. James? <coughs> I've lost visual. Uh... 
This is the uh, Ouroboros thing. Oh, it's Rachel. Will you come back to me? James. Hmm, that's strange, isn't it? Sarah? James, where are you at? I'm sitting on the crapper at home. You want more detail? Because I can give you more detail. Whatever. The feds are on their way there, so consider this a heads up. If they find you, I don't fucking know you. Are you? You're serious? We've been friends for fucking decades and you're gonna hang me out to dry? <laughs> yep, he did. How's the situation? They're coming. Time to clean up. Sarah, if we're gonna keep working together, you're gonna have to promise me something. What? I've been honest with you from the beginning, and I need you to never do anything behind my back again. We clear? James. Okay, as long as you keep being honest with me, I've got your back. Okay? From here on out. Then we've got a deal. Yes. Now, come on, move before they bust us. I'm gonna I'm gonna reconstruct everything back to where it was and then at least then I don't leave anything behind. Nobody will even know I was here. How do I put this away? I didn't check anything on, up here on that. I don't know whether I have time for that though now. Oh, it's only... It's fine. We'll leave it. <clears throat> us all into in the gut of a body not my own I can feel this case is nothing but trouble and heartache and even worse it's personal a lit cigar pressed against a wound that never heals that's me the second time I've seen Icarite completely melted. Just when I got a little better at forgetting the first one. I'm, I'm loving this style, I'm not even joking, this is amazing. Okay, we're in an elevator. I didn't think they'd still have elevators. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Yo, he's actually... This is actually crazy, where are we? Are these the, uh... Apartment complexes or something? Maybe. Nice. Still do graffiti. The mixture of odors in this place coats the inside of my nostrils like grease. Almost like that chocolate at Green's place. Almost. 10,000 steps every day. Your body needs it. I'm sorry, but how are you supposed to... Elevator to ground floor. Even cops don't go down there alone. You know, this is kind of creepy, to be honest. Like, oh, there's blood there too. It's kind of, it's, you got that like nice, well, I wouldn't even say this is nice or old, but you've got like a, yeah, the horror of what's to come in the future, basically. I 
supposed to be high tech, but still looks run down. Someone's coughing over there somewhere. Watch yourself and others for the common good. Yeah, yeah, we know that. Give back our bodies. Wow. Yeah, like, you're fighting for your own body, for God's sake. Like, you see what I mean? You, there's, like, this really, like, cool feeling that you're in, like, some future cyber cyberpunk sort of space. But it's quite dystopian and kind of daunting and, like, a horror. F we have uh, neighbours fighting about who's paying off bodies instead of like oh i'm paying off this mortgage nah 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 uh, who's paying off your body fella i think i get right to any all of it do you know what i mean right, what's happening in here what's in there rent unpaid well they're in arrears so god's body good price <laughs> yo these posters are actually cool and i like them Uh, one seven two five three seven rent paid. Is that how many? Why Terrell? Ah, and J. Cara. Oh, that's Rachel and. Where's Rachel? Then she died. Has she passed away? Yo, I just noticed actually. What the hell? We're using old phones. Oh. As a, a way of opening the wow, that's a cool way of doing it. Welcome home, James, Kara. How was your day? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. I'm glad to hear that. Due to the high level of air pollution, I recommend full body decontamination. Okay. The Batbreaker 2244. 100 in one season. The parties at Santa New York smashed it with the ball during the game. The truth is, it was after the game. And I had a ball-shaped stone trophy. A football trophy. Hmm. Player of the year, 2237. Actors in their own bodies. Now that was cinema. I am full on invested right now, and I actually like it. Exit? What do you mean, exit? Oh, wow. I f you get some proper, like, uh, like, no old time trying to police feel the strength of justice you get an old classic like crime detective like film feeling from this and but you also get like the future Icarus sky bar usually flies over Manhattan only the elite are allowed entry and there has it they've got the last bottles of real scotch up there like, you get some full, like, I'm getting, like, Bioshock vibes. The sun turned out to be the price for immortality. Nobody remembers when we lost sight of it. Once upon a time, bugs swarmed around neon signs. I'd say we are worthy successors. Well, this is cool. Is there any reason for me to be actually be out here? Uh, 
I miss this sight. In the first days after changing into this shell, the shakes were so bad I couldn't come out here. This infernal racket is the pulse of the city, the main artery leading to the CTC itself. The city sprawls in every direction. It's only a matter of time before it starts devouring itself. Like, how are the buildings up there coming down? Like, that's that's the weird part. That's the weird part. I don't understand. I'm getting confused. It's an amazing view to say it's not a clean environment. You know what I mean? Like, I, wow. They've they've definitely captured that dystopian cyberpunk sort of style. With a bit of noir. Is it noir? I don't know. The, um, I think it is. What is this? <laughs> um, that's for Tom at the bar. And if you need some booze. I'm good. I'm alright. I've... We've got a full canteen. Right, let's head back inside. Let's carry on doing what we're doing in here. President calmed people down, promised to veto, and then what did he do? He signed as soon as the bill landed on his desk. The president is nothing but a pen in the hand. Did you hear? He signed it. That lying piece of shit. Trend is us to shake the city. How much time has passed? I feel like I'm taking them more and more often. One brush with the oh, we have happy smiley face on it, yeah. Happy pills. You're lucky I don't need to water you. Depend on me. You won't have long to live. What tree is that? New body allergies. Can't even read that. Heaven nuts. Mm, mm, yeah. There's a, a few allergies. I ain't pronouncing them. I don't want to look stupid, thanks. Now right, let's go to the bathroom. Let's go do some decontamination. As usual. Finally. Wait. Wait. Did the... Did I call the bathroom? Did, so did this bathroom just come up an elevator or something? More ambrosia pills. Alright, well, that's nice. We got them everywhere. Current module, shower, available modules, decontamination. How are you still not in it? So it is. It's like a the shower's like on, a, on an elevator sort of style thing. Cool. All right. You know, if it wasn't for that badge, I would have fucked you up a long time ago. Yeah, hey, right back at you. Oh, cocky, are we? Well, what's your first move then? A powerful right hook. Amateur. Who starts like that? Block, left, right. They're picking you up from the ground. What nothing? <laughs> that is just amusing. <laughs> They're just arguing with your neighbor about the uh It's hard to get used to a face marked by someone else's mistakes. Though for some reason, 
It's much easier with the eyes. Once the life fades out of them, they can belong to anyone. What is that? I really want to know what that is. Well, you can have it back, you funny. It's time to take care of it. I'm gonna need more space to fire up the evidence board. I looked at that already. And let's uh, clean up a little bit. Sarah, How's the job going? To complete my report, I need to summarize the evidence. I need access to the system. You heard Chief Steiner. He wants it classified as a suicide and sent straight to him. Uh, should the report be professional or not? I'm senior and need access, okay? Sarah, I'll owe you. Um, we were supposed to put our cards on the table. We were supposed to put our cards on the table, so that's what I'm doing. I appreciate that, but we have one more problem. Do you think I don't know why the chief put you on restricted duty? I read your wife's case file. <sighs> uh, forgive me for mentioning her, but it was the same kind of suicide. Sarah, listen to me very carefully. We're in this together. And it's a lot bigger than the chief. Sooner or later, the report will make it to the top brass, and we'll both be fucked. Unless we consider all the circumstances in the report. Oh, fuck. Mm-hmm. <sighs> okay. Okay, you know what? Here's what we'll do. I have access, so I analyze, and I put the evidence on the board. Is that clear? As clear as day. Okay. I'm... Uh... I'm sorry for bringing your wife up like that. I don't want to know what happened. Let's not fight. Let's connect the dots one by one. Ooh, we what are we doing here? We move on. You'll agree with me sooner or later. The sooner we get this over with, the sooner you can write the report. Now, what we got here? It's the spirit. I should clear up Sarah's doubts about the murder. First, I have to prove that somebody else was there besides Green. And when Sarah takes the bait, I'll convince her about the rest. Okay, okay, then we're trying to convince Sarah. Okay, fresh wound on the back socket in the shirt. He could have cut himself, maybe. Like how? Shaving? Oh, so what do I do? Do I connect? What's this? Sarah's doubts. Got a check mark on that now. Uh, it's a wound. We got. It. Uh, bloody trail. It'd be really hard to do something like that to yourself. What other clues indicate a third person? This one? Indeed. What else do you need? A lot of money, promotion, happiness. <clears throat> That's after we've solved this case. Oh, how lucky I found you. Okay, we still have shit, but we can at least ask two questions. First, what's the actual cause of death? Second, who's the culprit and what's his motive? Are you saying you're getting involved? I've already changed my mind. Are you the same with guys? I won't correct you on everything you just said that was wrong. Besides, I'm looking for more information about the evidence. But seriously, no more jokes. 
Bottle marked to the straight snake symbol containing a strange thick fluid. I found some interesting tidbits. Please share. Only with friends. But I'll make an exception for you. He didn't glow at night by any chance. Because of everything in his blood. Many drugs are rare, withdrawn, or from government projects. Wait, how do you know if green doesn't glow at night? I don't want to talk about it. We haven't known each other long enough. Oh, look at that stairs there. Oh, what's this one? Cause of death. How did he die? It'll be hard to defend the theory about these cables. The moment of the fall is puzzling. I want to say that someone kicked him, but we don't have enough... Right, so not that. I would say the explosion. But I don't have an explosion one. Somebody had to be pretty damn determined to fuck Green Zikarite up this bad. Oxide Zikarite means a final death for one in a billion case. How could this happen? There's nothing complicated about this. But what next, James? This is clear, and... I know. Give me a minute. How about... Top... You know what? This... Now we only need the motive and the perpetrator. Yeah. Then tea and we'll find Kennedy's killer before an evening snack. Hmm? Oh, jeez. How did you even get through high school? How did I pass? I so the... the... I forgot, and I was fucking great at it. Right. Now I remember. The uh, case report that he had on his, or the, I, I didn't see his journal, but I saw the case report, what well, sort of. And we put the journal there as a potential motive. Jane Salmer and Krav Krav Kovalev, they're the only ones Green had meetings with on the day he died. So it's one of those two, or it could be somebody else, obviously. The last to see him, two people saw Green the day he died, a smuggler and a psychiatrist. Either have a mo could either have a motive. Let's put that there. Apparently cool. he had a heavy foot. He was just showing off to a girl. If I had such a fancy car, I wouldn't need a girl for anything. James, right, so just before the incident near Green Green's apartment, a traffic camera caught park speeding with his arm around Jane Salma in the passenger seat. And I don't have any more regarding other people, so let's put that one there. No, it's not that. So it's not that one. The reconstruction shows green tearing cables loose and flooding the transformer with alcohol. call that would That's what caused a short circuit and started the fire. Must have happened before. Maybe he shot someone? This is quite a lead. Who's doing the beating? A fucking ghost? Excellent question. Uh can we use this? Got something? No, it's nothing. Can't use this one yet. So Not that one. I thought the skin crawl. You don't want to know what it's doing to mine. I don't have. I didn't say you were. Now stop yelling. 
James, this is fun, and I'd play three more games of Solitaire, but it won't prove anything. What else do you need? More facts, or it's a waste of effort. I'm trying to organize this a little bit. Trying to organize this <laughs> okay, so I can see a bit better. So whatever this one is, it's leading towards... Put that there, put that... There. Right, now at least I can see, so... We have the wound and the server's doubts fixed. This could go there as well, so... Right, we've got... The Severus Doubt's sorted out because of the wound on his back. There's no way you are going to do something like that to your back on your own. Somebody has to do it. So you probably got stabbed or he's probably, um, I don't know. Someone's, I don't know. Probably got shot. Could have been absolutely anything. We don't really know. And then obviously following the bloody trail kind of shows the beating when he had his face pummeled into the floor. Which obviously leads to told you so, which is the case. We had guests. What do we know about them? Kovalev is a smuggler and the owner of Icarus. And Salma, as you know, is that famous psychologist and a psychiatrist. A smuggler and a shrink. Quite a pair of farewell guests. I'm hearing our neighbors. I agree with nothing. Right, I can't move them. So, we got to here, so we've got told you so. So, obviously, we've convinced Sarah that the um, someone was doing it. This wasn't suicide or attempted. And it's helped convince Sarah about it. Uh, the person had guests, or he spoke to Jane Salma on in Kavalev. Which are the only two people that met him. So they're the two that we currently got as prime suspects. They were the last people to see him. And we don't really know much about the pocket watch. But we know that links to probably who did it. Uh, the cause of death. He did die by the Icarite short circuit and not being burnt out. Which then caused his final death literally. He's never coming back ever again. Because his uh, Icarite got burnt out and fried. So he can't transfer his consciousness into another body. So that's uh, just how that is unfortunate for him. It was too severe. Which then led to tox to toxicology report. Which is large concentrations of Ambrosia. So he got drugged as well. Which could have helped him go quietly, potentially. And now we have the home stretch. So this is the last section that we have, which is the former smuggler might have dosed green with poison that destroys Icarite with, but we're missing the murder weapon. So I'm thinking this. Whatever this is. Because we don't really know, all we know is it does some funky stuff to our systems when we actually, like, pick it up or do anything with it. So, we've just done it, we've concluded it. Sarah, I have something for you. There may be something in the bottle, something that Kovalev used to destroy Green's Ic Ic Icarite. It's time to go all in. Let's conclude this analysis. I think that looks pretty cool. Pretty good. I think we got it covered as best we can anyways. And this layout, I think, has got it quite, got it down quite nicely. Well, let's conclude this. We need to talk seriously. Is this some lame engagement joke? What? No, it's, it's not like that. I, I just have something for you. If it is, however, some stupid joke, I will get fucking mental on you. There is one more piece of evidence. Sorry? Why don't I know about it? It's not in the archive. Because it's not a photo. Oh, wait a minute. <sighs> Tell me you're joking. 
I'm begging you. It turns out I think it is indispensable. You took physical evidence from the crime scene? They'll put us in jail for this. Oh, shit. I take it back. I'd rather have the engagement ring. It's beautiful. <laughs> A vial of strange liquid. Probably poison. This creepy voodoo symbol on it makes it more mysterious. More importantly, the material of the vial might retain fingerprints. What do you think? Show me. If you have any more stolen evidence up your ass, you better get it out now before you hurt yourself. Not this time. Consult your doctor. There's even a term for it. Kleptomania. Symptoms include paying for it someday. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Right, where's this bottle? Because the last thing I remember was actually holding it. Your arm code? Nine, seven, fucking six. Around Liberty Island, huh? None of your business. Nine, seven, fucking six. Get that sent over. Everything was in Sarah's hands now. Which was neat, since my own hands were shaking in a delirium I inherited after some punk I've never known. And one more thing, in the meantime, please send that damn report. What about evidence analysis? You got evidence illegally, and you want to put it in an official report? I'll send it as is. Maybe we'll find something else later. Or we can just pretend none of this ever happened. A complicated and unfortunate accident in which Icarite... Damn it, what am I doing? A specific fraud theory that doesn't quite... <laughs> you, you know it's all bullcrap as well. Enough. Yeah. Numerous clues indicate the involvement of third parties. Suicide or accident is excluded. 